Hello, ladies, gents, and brainless planned zombies. It is more Halligatry Adventures with Butthole! And she's ready to continue obliterating the opposition. My bad, my bad. It's not Halligatry. That's not the way you pronounce it. I was told in the comment I was corrected. It's actually Halligatry. So from now on, that is the way I will say it. Let's explore this Halligatry and then destroy all of its denizens. Oh, jeez. That is a giant crystal, uh, crystal shotgun that these scumbags are blasting in my mouth. Very upset. Oh, we, got, we got that done. I know that we have murdered these, oh boy, these filthy snails in the past. Let me just destroy the last one. There you go. These dirty snails, I already have slain them in the past. Let me just enable my incredible torch. I just like the reflections and the lighting that it gives on butthole. It's very nice. What's the way to go for here? Just jump across, right? Uh, ah, got there, baby. Get destroyed. So I, I have switched to the massive swords because the fire... I think makes a pretty fat difference. Staggers the crap out of my enemy. So it'll uh, help out as we go past this place. I mean, it, it makes sense that fire based weapons. This is stressing me out. I mean, we can burn a bunch at once. Haru! Good thirst! There you go. That will do it. Easy, baby. It just makes sense that fire-based weapons will destroy the enemy. I don't think I went up this ladder. I don't know if I've already seen what's up here, but pretty certain this ladder has not been used at any point. It just so happens to put me back where I was. Oh, yeah, 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 we did use it. All right, okay. I believe that just the way forward is going down that way. It's been a little while since I was last traversing these lands. There's the ladder. I don't think I need to use it. It's a very easy way down. Let's just obliterate every monster that stands in my path. Is that a Leonine? No, it's just a regular misbegotten, right? Destroy! Still alive? No. Off with you, filth! Disgusting, deformed piece of garbage. Okay, so I was told... This is only so you can get over to that branch. Is that something I want to do in my life? I am quite the obstinate idiot. Let's do it. Is there a reason? Oh, so we can get the butterflies. The Aeonian butterfly is so a very high value target right there. I am so happy that I risked my freaking life to get that done. All right, these scum lords scattering about the place. Defending these gazebos need to go. I know, I know that you exist. I'll get to you, bitch. I'll get to you. Oh man, you're you're a hell of a tanky son of a bitch, aren't you? So, just need to exercise extreme aggression. That's the way butthole deals with problems. Can I just shoot this into the wall? It does not work. I was like, maybe if I shoot this into the wall, it will be perfect. For my purposes. Holy crap, he has a big hammer. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'll do it! <laughs> I respect you, buddy. I respect your incredible ability to concoct enormous bludging objects with which you can crush my skull. I can relate to that drive a great deal. Uh, we, You and I, we think alike. Lots of things in common with trying to bludgeon our opponents into submission. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Let's see what this gazebo holds for butthole. Oh, this is an elevator. Let me just hit the elevator. Maybe it just creates a shortcut. It goes up. If it goes up, it probably creates a shortcut. Maybe it puts us back where that contraption was at. Yeah, look at that. Shortcut achieved. Let's go back down. 
I'm ready. I'm ready to finish this game, I think. And I think, like, unless there's some kind of weird last minute plot addition, it just feels like we are at the end of it. Uh, this is all supposed to be like a secret place where you're not even supposed to go in the main storyline, as I understand it. But you do all this, finish it, and then you go over here to burn down the tree, and I think that just gives you access to the throne, and that's the way you win. That is the way I believe it goes. Don't know if there's anything beyond that. This looks extremely suspicious. Let's do... Uh, okay, this is... If this is not an arena, I don't know what is. I see the fog wall. I'm pretty sure that fog wall is to block me in to this gigantic arena, so... Here comes the pile of buffs. That's right, we don't use the electricity or the buff to the weapon anymore for it is now writhing with disgusting flesh. Guess I will take the blessing of the earth tree as well. Looking pretty good. Maybe I'll, I'll even open with the unendurable frenzy. In we go to face the horrendous danger that lies within. Lady on a... Lady on a horse, Loretta, Knight of the Halleck Tree. Let's see how you do against the unendurable frenzy! Well, that was not the greatest frenzy attack I ever saw. Ow. She has a freaking uh, rifle! AR-15! Loretta. Well, you did take quite a bit uh, uh, of damage. Are you on do it like a crazy amount? Loretta, aren't you... Then we find your ghost. Back at the Carrion Academy. Oh! <laughs> well, alright. Loretta can... Uh, can definitely... Use some serious aggression. I'm also seeing that he ha she has some big delays. On her attacks. Can I just run? No, you cannot run sideways to avoid that. Why is my... <laughs> my Estes so low? I did not uh, recharge it before engaging in this. That's probably what's gonna get us. That's the uh, swords that you can definitely run around. Jump it. I don't know what this is. Probably an explosion. I need more stamina. Start running, butthole. Start running. Oh, that hurt. Mistake. Oh, no. Run sideways. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Just keep running until that stuff comes over. Woo! <laughs> Okay, we are at the end of our rope here. It's not good. Somehow jumped over that. That was pretty good. Wow, you missed. You missed, Loretta! Let me punish your miss in the most fulminating way possible. I apologize for humiliating you this way. But Butthole wins again. Loretta wore sickle. I mean, Butto was fully buffed with fully upgraded weaponry. She better freaking win. What is, kind of weapon is this? Show it to me. It looks like a pole arm of some kind. Uh, Loretta's War Sickle, it, of course, skills with intelligence. Intricate, intricately, intricately crafted silver War Sickle wielded by Loretta, Knight of the Luckily, originally given for service as a personal guard to Carrion royalty, the weapon's blue glintstone has been replaced with unalloyed gold. Very cool. Cannot equip. I mean, I can equip it, I can't use it. Fantastic. Wonderful little interaction there. I am glad that I absolutely trounced that Brad. So we can keep on going. Butthole is just unstoppable. She just cannot be vanquished. There is no obstacle that she can face that she will not just demolish on the first try. Let me just get those levels. We've been leveling strength. 
thanks to figuring out that, hey, it actually gives me tons of damage, <laughs> especially with the heavy side. Mm. I'm pretty sure that that's what we're doing, right? Just, just pumping that strength as far as it will go now. I'm done putting points in anything else. Just a shitload of strength. How, how about dexterity? How, does that scale pretty good with the fire weapons? It does. It scales pretty okay. But I think... I think overall... Strength for all my armaments. Strength is the way to go. So let's just put the points in there. Spend the runes as we get them. Because there could be... Uh, falling off a ledge at any point. Wasn't there a, a gate? There was a fog gate. Was this what we were seeing from the dis distance? I thought it was attached to the wall. Let's go over here. Could have sworn that the the gate I saw was attached to the wall. I, I don't think I'm correct in that assessment. All right. Off goes butthole. Down this Spiral staircase. What else may lie? At the bottom of the electric. So it's actually we still got quite a ways to go. We may have only started the holic tree. Don't think ahead. It's like a dream, but snake. Oh snake! I don't think he made it. <laughs> I have a feeling the poor bastard did not make it. Oh, man, I want that. Wonder if there's a way to get it. As in, you know, cheese. As opposed to actually having to get there at some point through legal means. First off, ahead. Why is he always death? All right. If they said first off, ahead, I believe you. I'm sure that we're going to just come up here. Uh, gather our just rewards for the work that we have put in. More Aeonian butterflies. Aeonian butterflies in the electric. It's a little. Uh... Ooh, nice. I'm for at least not somber. Is there going to be rot ahead? Is that what's going on? If there's Aeonian butterflies. Freaking. And there was also rot in the damn trees, was it? The, the, the stupid flowers, they uh, spread scarlet rot. The core of the Hulectri is completely rotten, isn't it? That's, is that the, what it's hinting at? Bring that back up. Alright, only darkness and despair at the bottom. You are all liars and thieves. This never leads anywhere. You will not get me. Elfael, brace of the Holectri. 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 This looks like an encounter with another godskin piece of trash. They seem to congregate around freaking bridges. Oh, there's a dude over there. Does the guys that wear in the castle... What was it called? You're not attacking yet, are you? What was that castle called that we saw... It was in the northern part of over here. What were you called? The Shaded Castle. This fellas. Well, I'm not going to let you attack me first. Eat one of these, bitch. <laughs> we, we have alerted him to my presence. Okay, that took away half his freaking health pool, so I am not terribly intimidated. <laughs> Just do what I do best. Oh! Our new rotten waifu. What horrible STDs will it transmit to me once we do the nasty? I don't know. I'm willing to find out, though. Again we meet. I can only surmise our purposes are aligned. I too surmise this. Allow me to explain myself. I am of Melania's blood, but in what capacity I know not. I could be sister, daughter... You're a clone! Shoot. Whatever the case, though, I am certain of a kinship between us. Melania would be Mikola's sister. 
there is something I must return to Melania. The will. The lady in the tra in the introduction. The, the sense of self that allowed her to resist with the, the sword without a handle. Rot. Yeah, I mean without a hilt. No, a cross guard. To meet Radon's measure. There is something I must return to Melania. The will that was won. The dignity. The sense of self that allowed her to resist the call of the Scarlet Rot. Aren't you high and mighty? Well, you, you think you just know better than her. Maybe she just hop, loves that rot inside there her belly. Something I'm okay, the you're repeating will. yourself. Well, uh, wish you good luck in your endeavors. I bet they have nothing to do with me. I wonder if Melina will be talking to me right now. Nah, I'm wondering that. At every freaking side of grace, I'm like, man, my long lost companion. Wonder what she'll be doing right now. These guys are new. I mean, not those guys. Those are pretty uh, box standard, but this guy right here with the horn. It appears that you are now dead. Oh, he explodes! Did he explode? Stop. He shines. Is that because he's about to blow up? I wonder why he shines. He has this uh, glow. Maybe it's just the warmth of his kindness. It's just pouring out of him. He's just such a nice person. No pickle ahead, so to speak. Oh, required ahead. Ah, I see. <laughs> Be wary of unguarded butthole. Look. Appraisals zero? That's a crime against humanity. Absolutely applaud this message. That is some fantastic... Oh, this is people. <laughs> Murder! Murder now! Okay, the fire still seems to do great things. Let's go for our scythes again. Compare and contrast. Probably the Grave Scythe with just two more points of strength does a lot more work. Oh, by the way, I completely forgot to mention, I did go back in the electric and found a path up to the fatty with the trumpet, murdered the crap out of him, picked up the Oracle Envoy Ashes, and uh, I think there was also a fat-ass smithing stone. Ashen remains in which spirits yet dwell, Spirits of the Monstrous Band of Musicians who employ sacred arts. It is said that when Oracle envoys appear playing their pipes, they do so to herald the arrival of a new god or a new age. That's why they play their trumpets wherever I go. Perfect. They are the heralds of my coming. No pickle ahead, so to speak. Oh, require ahead. Amazing. Fellow, stop staring into the abyss and die. Eh, I think that that does a lot less damage than a double strike with the swords. Can I light this up? No. But I can go down that way and then uh, jump down. But that, of course, would leave me stranded. Hello. You appear to contain a multitude of runes. Twelve thousand. Hello, friend. Yeah, I like these guys. They are complete pushovers. <laughs> I, I approve of them. Hey, let me show you my butthole! Oh, this, yes, yes. Nobody expects the butt attack. Something I like about the scythe is, you know, you can make it into a holy weapon of vengeance. Hello, sir. Bye. Ow. Death! I really don't want to jump down just yet there was a way up this way hello sirs and madams I come to obliterate you with my butt survived, he survived, incredible how could he withstand the incredible might of my butt cheeks alright I think by now the scythes have been surpassed by the great swords, for sure. I don't know why you glow. They just destroy you. I don't know why you're just staring into the distance when you, your friend and companion is being slaughtered right behind you. For shame, sir, madam. 
Absolutely shameful, your display of uncaring callousness. Unable to acquire every bolt. This would exceed the maximum able to be held in inventory and storage. I have too many bolts. That message stresses me out. It makes me want to, as soon as my, as soon as my buff wears out, wears off. Oh, I see that you're holding up a great shield and preventing my advance. But will you be able to prevent the advance of the death from above? Gush! Actually, he is able to prevent death from above. That's all right. He's roll around like a boss. I'm <laughs> murdering him anyway. Let's go into the inventory. Where are all these bolts? Show me these bolts. That will be an equipment. And then you go over here. Apparently, I have just too many in storage. I don't know of which variety. Let me just take these. Uh, and that will be... No, I think you just need to... Equip, remove, uh, switch display, sort, simple view, help. I think you need to go to inventory and go over to the ammunition and find those bolts. Come on, really? Ah, there you go. Discard. Let's discard 12 of them. Can I now pick these up? God damn it. I don't know what kind of bolts those are. Is it just bolt? Regular bolts? It just stresses me out to have that over there, okay? So we're going to solve this damn problem. Let's just find regular ass bolt. I do have 99 of them. Discard all of them. Ah, I can now pick up loot again. It just, I hate it to have that, that message. Okay, buddy. You look like my newest victim. Let's destroy you! Lord Sworn's Bolt. Oh, great. Okay, so that is a place that I can actually reach. You probably have a body, don't you? You think you can get me, but you can't. You can't get me, bitch! You're going to suffer! The incredible strike of madness. I like your style, though. Uh, big fan of your style. Please, down, down. Oh, I didn't want to shoot that. Please focus on the idiot that is trying to murder me. Instead of trying to kill the bug. Sir, you are a very ineffective guardian. <laughs> I must say. Uh, I don't mean to put you down. I don't mean to belittle your efforts to prevent me from entering the Hulik tree. But, yeah, not impressed. Ow. That being said, oh no, that's not what I'm to That being said, I do still respect you guys. You seem to be a pretty powerful dude. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, he, he can actually turn me a new asshole if I'm not careful, so. Be indeed careful. Okay, so there's a way down that. There's some stumping. I heard a stumping. Oh, hello! It's a vagina tree! How fun. I already went this way, right? I did not go this way. Just obliterate your face. Let's not get too cocky, though. Because if I get surrounded by a bunch of these scumbags, I will still get murdered real quick. I don't appreciate you. Hubris will bring me down if I am not careful. Hello, sir. What's up? Oh, excuse me. That was a backstab. Hoorah! Yeah, definitely the sides are now less damage. Maybe if I buff, they end up doing more damage. But by themselves, definitely not as impressive as the, as the double great swords coming down upon the heads of my enemies. Bunch of lazy scumbags. I had to come in here, get them all back to work. How long have you lazy scum lords been 
suckling on the teeth of millennia. She's paying you these big bucks in the paycheck to guard this place, and all you do is sit around and be completely worthless. Triple rings of light. That is indeed an incantation. But that's like holy order kind of garbage, right? Tori. It is not madness the way I like it. I would like to see a description. It actually requires more smarts that I can provide. One of the incantations of the Golden Order Fundamentalists. Presents three rings of light and fires them forward. The rings of light return to a position close to the caster. Before disappearing, this incantation can be cast repeatedly. A gift from the young Mikola to his father, Radagon. So Mikola was a... Was a, a, a priest? He was a holy little boy. At the very least. He knew his way around an incantation or two. Not just a user of magic, but an originator. A crafter of the holy sacred word. I, I'm ready to grab some extra help. If it takes slaughtering innocent creatures in the world, so be it. How many do you give me? Three? That's nice. I'm not one of these fellas. Well, I mean, if you're just gonna stare while I buff myself, so be it. So be it, you idiot! You should have done something when you had the chance. Now you're completely at my mercy. Hello, sir. <laughs> Okay, that was actually more powerful than I expected. But I uh, I apologize, my good friend. I don't think you are smart enough to fight around these columns. You're having a bad time figuring out how to fight around these uh, this gazebo. It's a bad time to be an NPC. Open this up. Do something good. Clean Rot Knight Finlay. Legendary Ashen Remains. That's an achievement that I just got. Let's see. I can put him on the on the roster for a little while. Let me go back to equipment. Get rid of Finger Maiden. I used the telescope for something. I forget. Oh yeah, yeah, to get a thumbnail. I'm like, why is this even in my inventory? To get a freaking thumbnail. Um Clean Rot Knight Finlay. I do wonder what the hell are the Clean Rot Knights. Legendary Ashen Remains. Used to some of them. Finlay. Or is it Finlay? I think it's Finlay. Finlay was one of the few survivors of the Battle of Aeonia, who, in an unimaginable act of heroism, carried the slumbering demigod Millennia all the way back to the. Look at that! She managed to defeat the feet alone, fending off all manners of foes along the way. Legendary. So I guess the Clean Rot Knight Knights are Melania's elite knights. They fought alongside her. I assume they have been corrupted in some way by the by the rot. They didn't start that way. They were not avatars of the rot. They just became consumed by it. Would be my guess. So he goes down to where Ray fought a bunch of monsters and then he goes over to the other side. So it does look like there is no, no furtherance of this path. I do think, though, that this is probably a little bit of a secret up here. I don't think this is the path that must be followed. This is something that I'm not supposed to even find. Oh, baby. I think that... I think that will create... Like the gargoyle sword. I can get a plus 10 on that. Is there even a weapon that I still want to make a plus 10 that I actively use? Maybe give it to the Golden Order Greatsword. Just because it's so neat. Or you gave it to the Blade of Calling to just shoot my ass. Should put this on my... 
you know, my alternative arsenal and have an awesome projectile instead of having to go over to the madness? Is there any other weapons that I'm carrying? Maybe put it in the Magma Worms scale sword, but honestly, I am kind of let down by these curved swords that are kind of lame. I don't think there's any other weapon that I have um, a big drive to make it into a plus 10. It's nice to have them, but I think we're pretty much done upgrading all these things. You know, the, the main arsenal that I've been using, uh, that I plan to use. So I could always just save it in case that we come across something that is like, Oh, awesome. We need to get this to plus 10, you know? That being said, we're probably very close to not ever going to be finding any answer. Oh, how do you even get here? My good old friend. How do you even manage this feat? You are disgusting, and I love you. How did you even manage that? I don't know, brother. But he just gets around. My good old friend, the dung eater. He just comes over here. I'm just gonna corrupt this weirdo. Maybe he did that first. Maybe this is where he originated. He first corrupted the brace of the electric. And then... Just went on about his business, corrupting Lindell. Lindell, I said. Lindell? Well, actually, I don't know. What's the actual pronunciation? I think it's Lindell. Okay, this looks like just death if I drop. I remember the vagina tree. I do want to go back to it. Oh, yeah, a little bit of a uh, frame rate drop here and there is pretty damn upsetting. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 don't follow. Clearly that just drops all the way to the bottom, but we don't want to do that. I mean, they, they hit fairly hard for being just regular foot soldiers. I don't want to mess with no pieces of garbage. So, let's see. Is there having this composite bow? I don't need this composite bow. Let's put... The Blade of Calling there. And I can do something like this. Yeah, it's not... Ah, no, he, he was blocking. Okay, without blocking, that's quite the hit to the face. Of course, you do need... You do need Fupu to do it, so maybe the bow is, is a nice thing. Excuse me. That's pretty pathetic. How is that going to ever cause Blight, friend? How is it going to cause the death blight? You need to spit that on my face 20 times in a row. I don't know what your intention is supposed to be with that effort. I don't respect it. Oh, hello. <laughs> you lazy piece of trash. Just hiding back here behind the tree branch. Taking a nap. I'm telling you, I need to come in here, take over. And shape up this guard of buffoons. Old Fang. Okay, that is that I seems to be communicated to the vaginatory area. Let's go up first. What? Somebody was bitching. Oh, this is what we saw from there. Alright. What's this idiot doing? I have half a mind to destroy you. Now I have full mind to destroy you. Okay, he is powerful. The butthole cannot be stopped. Is it time? Is it time to go down this path? Connect over there. I really feel like I have been... Uh, I have not come across everything just yet. And this over here, it is connected, as opposed to that over there, which seems a bit of a dead end. Up you go. I mean, you're, you're powerful. You, you hit pretty hard. Ah, yes, amazing. Let me show you mine. Get wrecked. Absolutely obliterated. Yeah, probably having the composite bow is still a fine plan. Golden Grievo. Well, I know there's uh, an enemy coming up to me right now. 
Okay, there wasn't. Uh, it's still fine. I'm not fat rolling, I'm not. Because we do want an option to be able to shoot without using focus points. That is uh, questionable, probably guaranteed death. That is scumbags with a ballista, all right. Guarded also by a vagina tree. I think the best way to deal with that is to drop from above, isn't it? You go over there and you go up the stairs and then you drop. That seems like the smart approach instead of going full frontal attack that would be kind of dumb. Okay, so I'm going to backtrack a little bit, make sure... Okay, that doesn't go anywhere. We want to take that one. Make sure I didn't miss anything. And then, if I don't find anything, I'll just be up there going down that way. I mean, this this path over here, the vagina tree is patrolling that, that bridge, and we can jump from there and there and there. But I think it is easable, easily reachable from the path that I just planned. So we're going to go that other way first. And if there's no way back... I'll just come back here a little time. I believe I have found some kind of path that I did not find earlier. There was a branch going up from almost the very beginning. Some piece of loot underneath the bell. McKellen's Knight Sword. That looks like a straight sword to me. Emo princess likes straight swords. Butthole, not so much. Sword forged by servants of Mikola of the Hulektri, with a design modeled after those carried by Carrion knights. Instead of glintstone, however, amber from the Hulektri is embedded in the blade. A sumptuous piece, yet it has never been offered to any knight. A nil starred sword with no master. Now I am the master! <laughs> Oh, sacred blade fires up a golden blade projectile. The armament retains its holy essence for a while. I mean, it's another holy weapon. It, ha it is a straight sword, which is not truly my thing. Let's find out, though, what it looks like. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. I bet it does pretty damn decent damage, but it's just not how we roll. It's not how Butthole does things today. Another discovery is a freaking ladder that goes all the way to this area. But it doesn't seem to connect. Probably you can just jump down. I don't want to jump down. Oh man, that's just death. Okay, well, I'm glad I can keep going. Yeah, I don't want to jump down. What we're gonna do. I'm going to stick with the original plan of going down that bridge, and I am sure I can get to that area right there, you know, where the patrolling vagina tree through that door. Okay, we're back in this spot with our friend Ferdinand, the corrupted, the poor bastard, seedless and bereft of offspring forevermore. And this is what we do. Go down this way, avoid a frontal assault. Oh man, this frontal assault is happening anyway. Uh, I'm being scarlet rotted. I don't know what's attacking me right now. It is filth of the highest caliber. It is a freaking plant. Hate it. Hate it. Ugh. I don't like killing plants. They're so boring. They're so boring. I'll just take this rot to the face, why don't you? I don't want to kill that plant. I'm sick of it. Flame cleanse me. Alright. Let's roll top off as we drop down. The scumbags! Oh, if I ever saw a prime target for a butt attack! Thirst! Who's still alive? Who's still alive? Attack from the back. Oh, what she said. Oh, excuse me. No chugging allowed. I'm the only chugger here. It's 
their voice is so laughable. They get hit by the thorns that we have in our gloves. Okay, what can we make happen here? I see a rot knight over there. Clean rot knight. You know what? I respect these fellows. Especially considering I am running out of health potions. We're going to go in here. I think I just used the golden bow. Never mind. Never mind. Going to go in here fully buffed. Maybe with the exception of the flask. Hussah! Oh, you're powerful. Oh, I don't know if I can take the two of them. <laughs> Good frontal attack, though. It's a good fat ass destruction. Oh, the butt attack is not going to explode, but uh, uh, still hits. My butt cheeks. They're still lethal. You, you're done. You're done. Protecting this place. A Klingra Knight Sword. What you got? Spirit and Arrow. Not exciting. Uh, just real quick, what kind of sword is it? Klingra Knight Sword. Is it just a straight sword? I don't think so. It's a, it's a great sword, isn't it? What kind of sword is this? It has its own... Oh, is it just a... It's a thrusting sword. It's a freaking rapier. Alright. Forming stone. Nothing exciting over on this, these parts. My buffs have been depleted. Let me just uh, replenish my butt attack arsenal. It's just a... I see the ladder. It's uh, slightly defended. <laughs> Maybe we can just go back this way. Uh, it does seem like there's no connection, though. I was really hoping for that connection to go back to the to the Vaginetry Patrol, but I, I will have to backtrack a little bit and get there. To be able to get there. Really thought there would be a, an indoors connection, so I wouldn't have to kind of strand myself down there. Oh, you absolute piece of garbage. Isn't this unfortunate? Here comes Bottle on the rear guard. Nobody expects the Bottle Inquisition. This looks like a sacred tier to me. Alec Tree, Soldier Ashes. I, my bad, my bad. Alec Tree, Soldier Ashes. Nothing to be found here. Okay, so probably this is gonna be death. Let's go up this way. I really don't want to face the vagina tree surrounded by other idiots. It's gonna be a royal pain in my asshole. Could this be a door? I doubt it. Okay, there's no way there. Certainly no way there. Why does this even exist? It is such an obvious path. Uh oh. Whee! Got there. Quick. Come on. Be careful, be careful. Fourth. Electric Night Helm. Will I fat roll if I done this just to mock them? No fat rolling, baby. Oh, that's one uh, beautiful looking door. Seems to be rooted shut. Go down. Hey, that is what I was hoping for. So I wouldn't have to redo the whole thing. Baby. Lost Grace discovered. So, the thing is, uh, I mean, I can always just go back to the other. So we can definitely do this. Also spend a the level. There you go. Amazing. Um, you can always just use the teleporter to just go back to Millicent. To face the other vagina tree. But this needs to happen. Grammy string flame. And this is where we will end the episode. Lesson of the Earth Tree. The Boulder's Blade. What don't we have, though? 
Golden Vow. There you go. Fully buffed. And we're next to the... Next to the... What's it freaking called? The Side of Grace. So we can use the flask. Wow, you have... You are one fat son of a bitch, aren't you? Oh no, it's a rot tree. <laughs> of course it's a rot tree. Man, you're, you're one fat individual, too. Yeah, yeah, we, re we respect this fellow. He has a big, fat, meaty health bar. I should give 20,000 runes. Can you come in here? You cannot. Well, that was the third attack to that. Probably should have known that. You are so fat. Oh, man, you're so fat. Bruh. This is a problem. <laughs> it's a real problem. The Scarlet Rod. Uh, excuse me. You nasty monstrosity. Uh, please? Okay, we, we, we want out now. We want out right this moment. Oh, but now there's the, the guard up there. They're going to ballista the crap out of me. If I go and, and try to fight. Do it. Just panic roll. Aha. Uh -huh. I don't know where the vagina there it is. Uh, I think it's just the knight that is destroying me right now with it. Great bow. Yeah, this is a, a cursed fight. No wonder they put. No wonder they put um, side of grace right next to it. It's like, you're gonna suffer on this one, buddy. You're gonna get wrecked by all this stuff we're gonna throw at you. Something like that. I just want the, the knight. I want the knight to come after me. So we can do a 1v1. Face me, bro. Fight me on dust. You can only get away with just a, a couple attacks now and then. Oh, that's badass uh, weapon of war that you got going, buddy. I don't know what you're doing. Oh, you are healing yourself. Bleed. These guys are the real deal. Like very respectable foe. Probably parry him. We try hard. Enough. You're dead, you're dead. Oh! <laughs> you're not supposed to. Oh! I just want him to die. Butt attack, double. <laughs> we didn't even get to kill the freaking knight. This is cursed. This is awful. What a horrendous fight. I mean, they do put the side of grace in a way around it, so it's not like you're they're forcing you to fight it. That's why you can't really resent it, right? It's like, this is optional, buddy. You don't need to fight it. You don't need to throw your face at this extremely unfair encounter. It's all you. The one that's suffering and provoking this suffering is all you. Butthole. She knows no better. She needs to face the most horrendous monstrosities known to the tarnished. For she will obliterate all opposition. On the next episode of Fun Times with Butthole.